Hey, it's Scotch Test Dummies. I'm Scott. I'm Bart. We got us a Kill Homan, another Kill Homan. We like Kill Homan. This is the Casado cast. Ooh, it sounds Spanish or Portuguese. We're going to test it. Lucky cat, lucky guest style. Ooh, really? All right, what is it? Portuguese? This Portuguese red wine. How'd you say? How'd you know Cusado. it sounded? Casado. My, Not... my wife learned. I don't think she speaks it now, but she can speak Portuguese. Brazil and Portugal. Boom. Not to be confused with Cal Calvado cast, which is the apple. Hmm. We had Calvados. We had some. There were, A couple of years ago, there were a few whiskeys come out from Calvados cast. Yeah. When I first saw this, that's what I was thinking. Real. Till I read the fine print on the box. Portuguese I don't know why it red made wine. Me think Portuguese, but I've also ordered some gaming, some role playing gaming pieces from Portu Portugal. Portugal. Uh, 2022 edition, and it says married in Portuguese red wine vats. Mm. Uh, let's go to the back of the box once again. Blah, blah, blah. You've got the Kill Homan. <laughs> a couple paragraphs at the first, and then the third paragraph, we've got Casado, Portuguese for marriage. Ooh was matured in fresh bourbon barrels for six years before 38 casks were selected and married together for two years in two 6,000 liter Portuguese red wine vats. Wow, sounds good. The two years spent in red wine vats has added layers of rich red fruit and mixed spices, balancing beautifully with the maritime peat smoke and citrus character unique to Kilhoman. If any distillery wants us to come visit Portugal, we will go. <laughs> I'm hearing it is awesome. Uh, I had some uh, uh, sister and brother-in-law went to Portugal, and they were in Spain a little bit. Now, they're from Puerto Rico, so they're, they're bilingual, although I don't know if they speak Portuguese. They said Portugal was unbelievably beautiful, clean, and awesome. So, And they said almost nothing about Spain. <laughs> so I was like, wow. They were like, Portugal, 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 Portugal. And Casado is from Portugal. 46% ABV, <laughs> 750 milliliter. Portugal. <laughs> Portugal Pete came off of the nose. Portugal Pete. Now that's, that was, that's the first amazing. note I get. We're back to Kilt. So we just did the Kilt Home right. and Isla Barley, lightly peated, a lot of other. Uh, notes going on on the nose of this one, Pete jumping out of the glass. We're back to Kill Home and Style. Sweet Pete. It's a sweet, sweet Pete. Pete. With a, it's like a sea salt. Nuttiness. With a barbecue. Nuttiness with a barbecue. I'm tasting. I've already yep, got go the salivation. I'm trying to now. see if I can get any of the fruits on the nose. You're puzzling. It's still, maybe Ooh. it's a little darker. Mmm. Ooh. Wow. Every once in a while, I'll get a peat that's got like a clay influence. This is like clay peat. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what that means. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Mm. A clay peat with mm -hmm. this warm, burning Bunsen burner. Again. Sweet. What kind of sweet is it? It's not, I mean, there is a little bit of citrus sweet. There's, I don't know, it's more like apricot, um, peaches, sweet, stewed, stewed fruits, yeah. cinnamon, oak, peat, salty. Oak shavings that have been soaking in the peat liquid. <laughs> I don't even know. Wow. Huh. What else is in there? Am I getting like a... It's almost like peanut shell. I'm, I was going to say peanut butter. Okay. It's almost peanut butter and chocolate. My Reese's peanut butter yeah. cups. I got like the, the dustier shell of the peanut, though. Like you're cracking them at that steakhouse that has that that bale, that little pail of peanuts. Sweet red grapes. Hmm. Juicy. Wow. Salted bacon. I guess all bacon is salted. You don't have to say salted bacon. Do they bacon. salt all bacon? Mostly. <laughs> I think we're back to that normal Kilhoman peat like we were talking about here. It's heavier. 
I'll, I'll agree with the clay pot, clay peat. Yeah. It's nutty, peanut butterish, fruity, red grapes. Everything but peanut shell. <laughs> That's what I get. That is good, though. I'd like to keep this one. Wow. Casado. Let's throw a drop of water. Mm, I'll do the same. 46%. I did like the 50% wow. of the high wow. barley. But that didn't show. If you would have told yeah. me. Yeah. It feels 50. Yeah, it does. It, it feels a little heftier than it is. Sea salt on the nose. Hmm. Hmm. Peaches, apricots. Wow. Ooh, I get a little more nutty character with the drop of water. And nutted it up. <laughs> wow. I think I still liked it neat, but it didn't take anything away from that salt, water, peanut shell. I liked it neat. Uh... I don't know that eh, it barely harmed it. It really kind of rounded everything out, smoothing out. I'm not getting anything different with the water. This was good and neat. Had a little bit more punch. That's where I'm sticking with it. Good That's stick. my story. And we're sticking, sticking with to it. it. Mm. All right. So, score-wise, I'll go first. 90. 90. Ooh. Right with nice. you. Nice. Right in there. That's yeah. a knuckle bumper. Wow. You've been working out. So that's good. I think, I think a little bit it. higher ABV or maybe even a little bit more depth, a little bit more richness. Really? If you, if you thought it was like bit. at a 52.9. Yeah. <laughs> that would have done it. 52.9, you would have been like, 95. 95. That's good. We're both in at a 90. When you and I unite on the same score, that's a very good idea because we're coming from different places. This is a special edition as well. Look and see if it says how many bottles. Mm. There was 12,500 of the, oh, 12,900 of this one. Wow. Same as the Isla Barley, $120. $120, where from? Huh? Where did we get it from? R&J. Oh, R&J Discount Liquor here in Wichita, Discount. Douglas and Hillside. Discount Liquor. Woo! Great so, selection of uh, world whiskeys and, and uh, for our region, great selection of scotch as well. That's good. Bourbons, everything. Love That's a, in our area, you always get more bourbons in the stores. Sure. It's fine in the stores with the good scotch selection, right. and the R&J is one of them. Yeah, I'll run across folks. They generally lean bourbon heavy, and they're like, really? You like scotch? And I'm like, yeah. So, But bourbon always, so when you find a good scotch selection, great R&J discount liquor. So you can help us out. We did purchase this ourselves. Go to Patreon, look up Scotch Test Dummies. Once you're there, you can support for as little as a dollar a month. That's nothing. You can go all the way up to a dollar a show. You can do five, or not five, three dollars, ten dollars. Boom. Help us out. Help us out. It's not ten either. I got to do what Corrine asked and up it. Go. What How about mean? if you were on the boardwalk and you had some, you walked by a cart, the cotton boardwalk. candy stand next to really? the roasted peanuts? Mm. Or you had a handful of roasted peanuts with some cotton candy on top of it? Oh, I can't imagine double fisting it, but yes. I see it, I get it, and I understand it, and I wouldn't disagree. Scotch it, you scotch gods. Slaunch it, dummies. dummies.